Okay, here we go. Part two of the Alpine Stars Charger suit. One piece racing suit, all new from A Stars 409. We're going to do what we always do in part two give you guys a look from the inside out. It has a removable liner. To do that, from the left side of the suit down here at the crotch, go ahead and grab the zipper. Come up. Circle around the top of the neck. You know, like we've been saying, this is really a heck of a value. I mean, this is, you know, kind of a, a mid-range price point, right? Tons of suit here. They've done a great job, some great features, all the Alpine Star quality. Undo the zipper. Here in the sleeve, we have Velcro. Okay, they Velcro the liner in here. Like so. And go ahead and tuck that up inside the sleeve a little bit. Let's go do the same thing on the other side. Velcro, Velcro. You know, Alpine Stars is really uh, the Charger suit and the Trigger suit. Both were new in 2009. They've really, really, really improved they're more entry level stuff and, and I got to tell you they're really separating themselves from a lot of other people by doing that. Here in the termination for the leg we have Velcro patch, There's several here. Go ahead and tuck it up a little bit. Let's go to the left leg, do the same thing. sleeves through. And here we go. Here is the liner from the inside of the Charger suit. Let's kind of go over all the armor that is in it and attached to it. Okay, you can see it's a nice, good quality liner, just like you would expect from Alpine Star. We have here, kind of in the outer arm area right here, a little additional energy absorbing foam sewn into the liner. To get a look at our shoulder armor, what we need to do is Open the Velcro pocket. It says install protection here. Open up the pocket. And here we go. Here is the CE certified proprietary Alpine Star Armor hard outer GP shell. Energy absorbing foam. Okay. Excellent coverage. You can see right there for sure. Kind of goes down to the arm a little bit. Covers the back of the shoulder. A lot of technology and testing goes into this armor. They use you know, all the racing they do, their testing lab. I think they've done a great job. For the hip and the quad, got a good measure of energy absorbing foam sewn in here. It's a great place to start. We still believe that adding on a pair of armored shorts to fortify this area is still an excellent decision, in our opinion. There is the liner. Let's go ahead and cast that to the side. And let's Let's go ahead and grab the elbow and forearm armor, undo the Velcro, and if you could zoom in here a little bit, Ryan, there is an armored pocket that's kind of sewn in here, okay? So you reach in from the top, undo the Velcro patch, and give it a tuck. Once again, it's the nice proprietary Alpine Star hard outer GP shell. Energy absorbing foam, tons of coverage, tons of articulation, very comfortable. Once again, they've done an excellent job. You can adjust this just a little bit in the elbow area if you need to for additional protection and or comfort. Chest armor, it comes in this, and we're going to show you that in just a moment. Normally, to remove this, you would open this pocket here because you'll have the liner installed, okay? So you can get the chest armor out without removing the liner. You just open this Velcro pocket that says install protection here. For the purpose of this video, we already have the liner out, so all you need to do is roll that out of the way. Here is the pocket the chest armor is installed in. Simple Velcro. And let's pull that out. 
This is essentially what you get. It's a piece of medium density foam. You can see it's completely perforated to allow the air to continue to flow through the suit. Um, this is upgradable. Alpine Star offers the bionic chest armor. It uses a hard outer GP shell. Still has some perforations for airflow. Slides in the same pocket. Quite easy to do. We think that's a great place to start. Um, we personally here at STG, we prefer to have a full coverage chest guard. Alpine Star offers one. We're big fans of the Knox product. This is the piece that Knox offers. It's a very serious piece. Fits well underneath all the suits. You can see considerable dis uh, difference between the two. Great start, perfect finish, okay? But nevertheless, Alpine Star is one of the only ones doing that, and we really certainly appreciate that approach. Let's pull the speed hump out. Once again, you'll see the tag here, install protection here. Grab that, pick the velcro. Go ahead and pull that all the way up to the top. Here is our speed hump. Now, you're going to notice this is all channeled out, all hollowed out. At the top of it, we have three openings. That works in concert with all of the perforation here at the top of the speed hump. When you're over in a tuck position, air is forced in through the perforations into here, flows in through the honeycombed race hump. It's like a gigantic air conditioner on your back when you're in a tuck. That is absolutely a great feature. You'll notice here, too, that this is just kind of a mesh, right? You can blow right through it. It allows the air to come right into the suit. Let's focus on the collar of the suit for just a moment. You can see the back portion of the collar here is leather, and it's perforated. It allows the heat energy to escape, okay? The sides of the collar are neoprene. The entire collar on the inside here, on the sides, it is lined with a microfiber. just keeps it comfortable against your skin. Here is the detail. It's kind of like a mesh material there. Now, like we showed you in part one, tons of perforation on the charger. One of the things that's very unique is it's using, you know, kind of a combination of a Raglan shoulder, okay, seam, and a standard shoulder seam. But realistically, the, this is the shoulder area, so it's going to be a Raglan shoulder. There's no seam right here to get damaged in a fall. We think that's a great addition. It's going to make the suit more durable for sure. Awesome job, Alpine Stars, as always. Here at the cuff, nice, you know, kind of a, a leather detail here. Just keeps it comfortable against the skin, right? That's the idea. Let's come down to the knee and shin armor. This is something that Alpine Star does that's very unique, and we will show you that in just a moment. Reach down inside, there's an armor pocket. Undo the Velcro, and here is the first stage of their two-piece knee and shin armor. Go ahead and undo that. I'm going to reach down into the same leg, just a little bit farther now. The second pocket, undo the Velcro, and I'm going to grab the shin portion of the armor. Now, Ryan, if you want to follow me here a bit, show you how these two work. That is an absolute ton of coverage. Very protective. We're big fans of the way they've done this. It's awesome work. Here is the shin protector. Proprietary A-Star armor, hard outer GP shell. Energy absorbing foam on the inside. And for the knee cup, same idea. GP shell. There are areas, you know, where there's a little cutout so it can articulate and move with your body. Okay? Energy absorbing foam on the inside. Both of these pieces of armor are basically slid into pockets that are sewn inside the suit. It's kind of like a heavy, you know, stretchy kind of textile here that's sewn in there. Here is the trim at the bottom of the suit. It's kind of like a little leather microfiber deal there. It just keeps it comfortable, okay, where it's going to touch the skin possibly. These suits, the Charger also offers a calf relief. If you're one of the riders with bigger calves, open this calf relief up. It's going to give you in excess of another inch of adjustment for the calves. Quite a good addition, we think. 